What is going on guys? Thank you all so much for tuning in. My name is Kyle and today we have a very special video. Uh, I am going to be doing a collection and a few other things for my vending business. But on top of that, at the end I'm going to be telling you how to enter the giveaway for the single head gumball machine or $50. I decided that I would give uh, the winner an option. Uh, just because I know not everybody is interested in the vending business, so this way they can at least have $50 to, I don't know, treat themselves to a nice lunch or dinner, or use it towards hopefully starting their own business or investing it somehow so that they can build their wealth. Anyway guys, let's go ahead and get right into the video and start collecting some coins. All right, so here we are at the first spot. It is a game store, as you can probably see. Now, this one has been sitting for about two months and unfortunately only had a measly $7 in it. Uh, now, they did say that some of the candy uh, didn't quite taste right, um, so I went ahead and switched it out uh, and put all new fresh candy in it, so hopefully it will do better next time around. All right, so here we are at the next location. Uh, this is actually one of my original locations when I just started the vending business. Uh, but go ahead and open her up. This one's been sitting for about three months and is definitely not a great location, but it's one of those that you kind of just let and sit and build up. Uh, but after the three months, there ended up being about $22, and that is after commission. Uh, definitely not a fantastic location, but just one of those that you, like I said, just let build up, and uh, over time, it definitely will eventually make you a little bit of money. Uh, here I am going ahead and filling up all the candy. Uh, I played around with different candies here a little bit, uh, but pretty much ended up being the same in sales uh, no matter what I did. So i um, pretty happy with just keeping it how it is from now out. Now we are at the next stop for the day. Uh, this is actually a UPS store. Uh, now this one is on a three month cycle as well. So it's been about three months since I've been to this one as well. Uh, this is probably uh, my worst performing machine or at least very close to my worst performing machine. So I'm not really sure why I decided to fill it up instead of just pull it right here and now. Uh, but I do end up filling up the candy uh, and then you will see later that I do switch out the machine for a, a single head gumball machine. Uh, but at the end of the day, it's still a location and sometimes locations can be hard to get. But open up the coin bank and there ends up being a measly $18 uh, for the uh, three months that it was sitting. So very disappointing again. Uh, so hopefully with the gumballs, it'll perform better. All right, so one thing I want to announce really quickly is that I am going to be implementing a question of the day uh, into every single video. So uh, I know Quick Play kind of does something like this over his voiceovers. Uh, Eli and Cody over there, if you haven't checked them out, definitely do so. Amazing channel. They've been growing really fast, and they just hit 6K subs. So congrats to you guys. Uh, but I'm going to be kind of stealing that idea a little bit because it's really cool. I really like that idea. So if you have any questions uh, about vending or personal finance or investing or anything like that, uh, just leave a comment down below like I know a lot of you do already. Uh, and then I will feature one or two comments in every single video and answer them for you. And of course, I will continue to answer them in the comment section as well. But this will also give you a chance to uh, make it into the video. Uh, just thought this would be uh, something kind of fun to implement. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, finish the rest of the video. All right, and the last stop of the day was the guitar shop, which had $32 after commission, uh, which is less than normal, but still pretty decent for one month. So I'm definitely not going to complain on that one. Now I'm back home, time to account up uh, what I collected for the day. Uh, go ahead and open up the container and dump everything out. Uh, this was definitely a very small collection compared to normal, but it was only about four machines. So I guess all things considered, that's not too bad. 
uh, in the process of rolling everything up here. There's a $5 plus a $4 and then 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 79 dollars altogether collected. So definitely not one of my better location or sorry, better collections, uh, but still I'll take it. It's passive income nonetheless. Uh, it only took me uh, about 45 minutes to an hour to collect all of that. So I'm not going to complain. Now it is time to go ahead and get uh, one of my single head gumball machines ready to go out to put in the UPS store instead of the four-way machine because uh, the four-way machine um, is just way too much candy for a location that slow. Uh, you could even say that I should probably not even keep the location at all, uh, but because I do have extra machines, I'd rather a very slow location with gumballs than uh, no location at all. So go ahead and got all those gumballs filled up. Now it's time to uh, lock her on up, get the, uh, the lid on, and go ahead and lock it down. Uh, you can kind of see that it is a little bit more difficult to do uh, things with one hand uh, while recording so hopefully I will have uh, some help uh, one of these days soon uh, so I can have someone come on the runs with me uh, to make it easier for me while I record and just have them uh, do all the uh, work for me uh, so go ahead and load this one up into my car um, get get it ready uh, like I said, difficult to do things with one hand for sure, so I do apologize if the uh, camera is shaky, but here's the machine that we just switched out. Uh, go ahead and show you the machine here and bring it upstairs. I do live on the third floor of my apartment, so it can be a little bit of a pain to uh, carry these things up and down uh, from time to time. All right, so here we go, get it unlocked. Uh, normally, uh, this actually did take me a little while to get it uh, unscrewed. Uh, I actually have this at double speed and it still took me that long to unscrew it all. Uh, but go ahead and take out all of the canisters. Uh, now, this location previously did have, as you can see here, a peanut M&Ms, the regular M&Ms, Go back over and Reese's Pieces or Reese's Pieces, whichever way you want to say it. Uh, so many people say it different ways. Uh, and then Skittles, uh, definitely bad having the chocolate at a location this low. Uh, and then this here is the coin bank. This was only here for uh, about a week before I swapped it out. Uh, so I knew there would probably be a few bucks in there, but I didn't expect much. Uh, but dump it out, and there ended up being three seventy-five, I believe. One, two, yeah, three seventy-five. So, all right. So finally, what you all have been waiting for is how to uh, get entered into these single-head gumball machine giveaway, and it's going to be really, really simple. Uh, all you have to do is like this video, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below and I would really appreciate it if you would share this video with uh, at least one of your friends or family so we can continue to grow. The more I grow, the more giveaways I will do so everyone benefits. And one thing I do want to mention is that uh, I am not going to restrict you to just a single head gumball machine. If you prefer, I will send you a $50 instead. So give you a little bit of leeway if you're not really interested in starting a vending business. Uh, you can at least get $50 to start whatever business venture you want to do. So just leave a comment down below, uh, one uh, entry per person. You can comment more than once, but you're only going to get uh, entered for one because I'm just going to write down every name uh, and then put it in a hat and pick one at random. And I'm going to be doing that on my first live stream is how I'm going to be giving, doing the giveaway uh, or announcing the winner is going to be on a live stream. Uh, my very first one, I will let you know later in the week when that is going to be exactly, so make sure you stay tuned for that. 
anyway guys that is going to wrap up this video and if you have any questions or anything like that please leave them in the comment section below and as always make sure you like this video and subscribe if you haven't already and i will catch you all in the next one